It's, my name is Ida Hansen Elven. I'm a Norwegian writer and director, and I made a short animated film called This Is Catherine. For those who haven't seen the film, can you tell us a little bit about what This Is Catherine is about? Yes, uh, it's a story about Catherine, who is um, she's trying to find her sexual identity by watching films and TV shows. Uh, but in a, when, in a way, she just ends up losing herself. And we follow her journey when she's trying to find out what it means to be a lesbian and, uh, uh, and all her feelings and thoughts. And she's struggling with anxiety and there's also a bit of romance in the story. Can you tell us about the inspiration behind the character in the film? Yeah, the inspiration is uh, is from myself. It's a personal story, um, so it's mostly based on uh, how I try to find my sexual identity by watching films and, and TV shows. Um, I grew up in a very small town in the northern part of Norway, and there was nothing. There wasn't any gay people there, so all I had was films. Uh, and TV shows and and it made me think that I had to be uh, a lesbian the way that I saw in the movies when I was a teenager and it took me actually quite some time to realize that I didn't uh, I could just be myself and that's also what this story is about just trying to find yourself and and trust yourself and, and and even though it takes some time to find out who that is that's also okay you can just you can take your time and yeah just find yourself <laughs> yeah was it important to you to make a film like this when you consider that part of the film is how people can construct not just their sexual identity but their identity from media and the culture that they like was it important to you to make a film where maybe somebody who is younger can watch a film and consume your film and know that you don't need to necessarily conform to what the media tell you? Yes, yes, it is very important for me to, uh, to tell a, a story about a gay character who is just, you know, searching for who she is and, and also make a point that the media, the films, uh, all this representation that we see uh, mostly, um, at least before, it was mostly stereotypes, and not just uh, lesbian characters, but all many other uh, groups of people are just one uh, one stereotype, and it's hard to find yourself in that. And it's important to me to to, to show that gay people can be lots of different things, and and also there is a lot of movie references throughout the film. And because Catherine, uh, the main character, is not only watching a lot of films, she is surrounded by them because they had such an impact on her when she was trying to find herself. And, and that's also something I wanted to, to say. And, and also as a filmmaker, as a lesbian filmmaker, I also have a responsibility to, to make that, uh, um, to make diverse representations and, and I want to contribute to yeah to different characters. Just from a technical point of view, can you tell us a little bit about the animation style and how long it took you to make the film and your decisions with that? Yes, it's a, it's a hand drawn um, and it's a combination of drawings and the cutout um, technique. Uh, because the, there is, as I said, a lot of uh, movie references in the film and those are made in a different technique, in cut-out technique, to, to stand out a bit uh, from the rest, which is just hand-drawn uh, and it's quite uh, naive in a way, the, the lines and the... And I think for me it's actually because it is a personal story and I have uh, always loved animation and I like to draw and it just came it it's in a way it made it more, more personal in a way to to just draw it myself basically <laughs> your film is screening here in the market at clermont can you tell us a little bit about some of your exper experiences and impressions of clermont so far yeah i love being here i think it's great it's it's a huge festival with 
short film, so that's that's really uh, that's really cool to be here. And also with the pandemic, and finally we can you know meet people again, and we can go to screenings, and, and it's not just digital. And I, I love that, and I love just being here. It's a great festival. Uh, maybe a bit. Uh, Chaotic because it's so big. It's it's uh, sometimes hard to find your way, but once you do, I love it. <laughs>